Quiet Crafter. My name is Madison and I am the owner of The Quiet Crafter. If you have stumbled upon this video, just searching the web, welcome. I'm so happy to have you. And if you are here because you bought one of my acrylic paint pouring kits off my Etsy shop, thank you for your purchase. It is greatly appreciated. Okay, so today I am going to be showing you um, a tree ring technique using the colors from the Earthscapes acrylic pour pack. So we're going to get right into it. If you've watched any of my other videos, you may have come to learn that I am a fan of pouring on a wet base. You can pour on a dry base, but I prefer to dry, pour on a wet base just because it makes the paint flow better. You get better coverage. Move this out of the way. Get that right there. Okay, now I'm going to start layering. So I use Artist Loft colors. Some of the colors I use are just straight out of the tube, and other colors I use, I mix. Artist Loft colors to get a different shade, like that lighter green that I started with. That's a mixed color with just some Artist Loft basic green, a touch of yellow, and some white. This is a teal. I'm also a big fan of this color. I'm going to throw a little white in here to break it up. This is the first time I'm going to be doing this using a tree ring pattern. I typically like to do this one in a flip cup pour because I like the color mixtures, especially with the green and the gold. You get tans, a lot of earth tones, which is why I had named this color pack Earthscapes. They are pretty much good. I only use about four ounces of paint for an eight by 10 canvas. When you're pouring and stretching the paint, you wanna make sure not to leave the layer on the canvas super thick because if you do, the paint will crack. So, all right, I think we're good. We'll dollop up with this and just some white. Okay, move that to the side. do a white base on this. <clears throat> just spread it out. Let it drip over the edges because when you are pouring and stretching 
you want to stretch that paint right over the edge of the canvas. Now I know that you see all the, these lines now, but all these paints are mixed with Floetrol, which is a self-leveling pouring medium. So those lines will go away. They will level out on their own. Okay. I'm pretty happy with that coverage. So for a tree ring, I'm just going to take my cup and I'm going to pour and I'm going to go slowly back and forth in a motion like this. Okay. So here we go. this on the corner. I just like to get the excess out. <clears throat> so we're going to start tilting. So you want to tilt just right almost out to the edges to start. And now we can start going over the edges. Okay, Ooh, I'll come back. You can keep stretching whichever way your little heart desires until you get it exactly to your liking. There's no right or wrong way to do these. Okay. Set that down. I'm just going to look around the edges. If you see any exposed canvas on the edges, you just take your glove, because I'm sure it is full of paint like mine is, and just tap where the paint is missing, just to give it a little coverage. Okay. I am very happy with this design. Do you see some cells? Now, because we have gold in here, metallics do tend to sell on their own, but I am going to hit this with a blowtorch just to see if we can get anything else to pop right out. some cells 
especially over in this area. Some lacing, got some beautiful green lacing. That metallic is starting to pop through right here. Very pleased with this outcome. Well, I would like to thank you for joining me. Please do not forget to hit the subscribe button for future tutorials and experiments. Uh, sometimes I just like to try new things. Um, but for these purposes, these are um, basic techniques that I'm just going through um, for people to follow. Okay? Again, thank you for visiting. Feel free to leave feedbacks, any comments, um, any techniques that I have not tried yet that you would like to learn. Leave your feedback in the comment section and I will try my very best to accommodate everybody. Have a great day. Bye.